Okay, I am now trying out the mop extension, which looks like that. It comes with two pads, a microfiber, a scrubbing pad, and a bristle brush that you cannot use with the mop heads. So I'm going to try and do just this little area right here. Those are stuck on sticky messes from twin toddlers. So let me try it real quick, see what happens. I don't know if I'm seeing any steam yet. Maybe. Oh, there's more steam. Okay. It's getting better. It took about a minute. Eh, 30 seconds probably. See a good amount of steam from the mop. Okay. I don't know if you're noticing, all the dirt is like easily be coming up. It's all being pushed towards the stove. All right, let me pause it. And I will wipe all those chunks up real quick. Okay, so I went over this particular tile quite a few times. I'm going to try and do magic racer, see how if I can get any dirt up or if it did a really good job at cleaning. That actually, those are just wet spots. That's no dirt at all. No extra dirt, I should say. This is a, so all of this is actually clean just from the steam mop. Now, of course, the grout, like this, I think it's Pop-Tart. <laughs> but the grout, we're going to have to go back with the bristle brush. But so far with just the tile, the tile is 100% clean. Like, there's nothing on the Magic Eraser that wasn't there before. So that's awesome. Approved as a mop. But it does say not to use on hardwood floors that have not been sealed, laminate that has not been sealed. So just be careful with those.